you guys. So right now I look kind of like an egg. I am very um, average at makeup, so this might crash and burn. This might look great. I don't have anything planned. So here's a weird hack. I learned to use tape to get your eyeliner like really sharp. And then I was like, you know what? I need this for literally everything. So I'm going to tape my eyes before I do my eyeshadow. Just because, like, that's how I normally do it when I, like, do creative stuff. I don't know. It just, it honestly just helps me shape it. I look insane, but, like, trust me, I don't know why. For some reason, this helps me. So now I'm going to take the Morphe Jeffree Star palette. And I am going to use the shade 1985 and put it everywhere. Okay, now I have a pretty neutral colored base. Um, what do I want to do now? In the same palette, I think I'm going to use the shade Back. It's a very light pink color. And I'm going to try to put it just right in like my inner corner and like scoot it out just a little bit. Because like over here I want some like bright pink. So now's the dangerous part. I'm gonna start taking like some brighter pinks, maybe a red, maybe a red. Maybe just pinks, maybe just pinks, but maybe a maroon, no, whatever. I'm gonna take some bright pinks and I think I'm gonna start to go out and then maybe in my crease with something darker. Let's see, self-made, like literally a bright neon pink. And I'm just gonna put it out here somewhere and see what happens. Oh my God, she's there. I am honestly doing so average, but like, okay. Magul, Magul, Magul. I literally can't pronounce this word. Magul, 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 whatever. This darker purple shade starts with an M, ends with an L, that's all I can tell you. Once I like blend it a little bit, I think it's gonna be real cute. Definitely like Valentine's Day colors. That's what I was going for. The shade Don't Know Her, a glittery pink. And I'm going to put it like on top of both of those. Like just build it, see what it does. Okay, now it's shimmery. That's it. I want to add like some glitter up in there. I want to learn how to like put the concealer down and then put like almost like a loose pigment on it, but I'm not that talented yet. Two in the first row and I'm actually gonna use my finger and I'm just gonna pat it on where the light pink is. Okay, so I really like how it looks right now, but I want even more glitter. So I have a ColourPop Super Shock shadow, and this is shade Ladybird, which, there it is. And these things freaking blow my mind. This little brush, and I'm going to put it over top where I just put my last shade, just because more glitter, love glitter. So this is my favorite part. I like to call this, um, damage control now i'm going to get a brush and i'm going to go in this random revolution palette and use this very light shade up here and i'm going to go under my brow bone i'm gonna go over here i'm gonna buff everything i'm gonna lighten some stuff i'm gonna leave some stuff alone so the shape of my eyeshadow is like the same on both sides pretty much 
So next I'm going to take an eyeliner, which this is Double Trouble by Absolute New York. It looks like this and there's two ends. There's this end and there's this end. This is why we have the tape, okay? We're going to try to make a wing and then just something in there and we're gonna try, okay? Okay, now this is the most soothing part, taking off the tape. Oh yeah. All right, now to fix our problems, this is what I do. I get a big brush like this and I literally blend it out. Okay, and then the last thing is this line from the tape like right on my eyeshadow. I kind of just like blend it and curve it back in. Now I feel like adding mascara just makes everything just look so much better. So I love Maybelline mascaras. I just, they're cheap, they're good, they work. Why change, you know? Done, I'm just going to do some very light contouring and then a little bit of highlighter and then lips of course so that took me way too long to decide so i'm going to use shade rico by stilla looks like this it's dark purpley red pink i don't know i like didn't want to commit to red but then i was like too much pink so i'm i'm just gonna use it okay this is probably gonna ruin it <laughs> That is definitely darker than I thought. I feel like it doesn't even match right now. How can we fix this? I'm gonna put this Wet n Wild lip gloss on top and it has like some pink glitter in it. It might lighten it up. And it's shade Pisces because that's what I am and look how pretty that is. Whatever, I'm just gonna roll with it. It matches my nails. It... Oh well. So I am going to get my little heart shaped sucker and I'm gonna take some cute pictures. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and linked in the description are all my other social medias so you can go check them out, follow me. I love you guys very, very much and I will see you next week on another video.